Hey, this is Chad from Tactical Hive. I'm here with Steven from Mantis, and he's gonna run us through uh, his simulated get shooting experience. The app takes all the data from the, the Mantis system itself. This is the Mantis system attached to the gun. Okay. It uh, functions for dry CO2 and live fire. And so whatever you need it for, it'll do that. And then you've got the free app um, that you download and install onto iOS, Android, or Kindle, Kindle Fire okay. operating systems. So let me uh, run you through a few shots and then I'll show you what the app is going to display to you as the end user. All right, perfect. All right, so what we're gonna do is start the uh, Mantis benchmark drill. This is one of many. This is gonna be 10 shots. And the idea is that you're giving yourself, uh, you're aiming, you're going more for accuracy with this, of course. So it's basically measuring kind of how accurate, does it show you where like your sights are going to see where, like what you're doing before the shot? It does, yeah, good question. So we're gonna jump over to that page. So, this was my 10th shot. This is all the movement that occurred for that shot. And you can zoom in. The, the breakdown is basically you've got the crosshair, the white crosshair is where our system detected I was aiming. Okay. And because our system doesn't require a special target, you yep. can aim it whatever target makes sense for you, blank wall or a silhouette, whatever. Cool. The white X is where my shot would have hit based on the movement that I induced while I was pressing the trigger. Mm. And so ideally that white X is gonna be right in the center of the white crosshair. It generally isn't. Yeah. Um, That's the hard part. <laughs> yeah. So the red line, that represents movement that occurred after the shot broke. Okay. And I believe that's point, uh, 0.05 seconds of time. Okay. The yellow line is uh, before the shot broke and that's point 0.15 seconds. And then the blue is the time prior to the yellow. So I focus generally on the red and the uh, yellow. And then you've got all your shots down here. You can kind of skip through and look at them and, and compare the score versus the movement. This screen here is what we tend to, or what the app defaults to. So you've got your average score because we've ended the session, but if you're in the middle of a session, it would show your last score here and you've got your round count up here and here. This, each band represents a shot in which I had movement in this direction, which was not ideal. So you press on that and it's gonna give you a potential explanation for why that movement was created okay. or what created that movement. All right, Stephen, well, thank you so much for talking yeah. to us. This looks like a great tool. Great for practicing, great for like figuring out kind of what's going on while you're shooting, so you don't have to go to the range and pay way too much for ammunition Definitely. and all the range views. So thank you so thank much you, for talking to us. Time. Hey, it's Chad Hadley for Tactical Hive. I'm here with Luke at Laser Ammo. He's going to tell us about his training product today. How are you doing, Luke? Good. Well, how are we doing? Doing very well, thank you for asking. Can you tell me more about Laser Ammo? You bet. So Laser Ammo makes a full line of dry fire laser enhancement uh, devices. So you can train at home or also help uh, small police departments or small military groups uh, to be able to train in a budget-friendly way. So we make everything from a laser cartridge that goes into your own firearm and emits a red laser every time you pull the trigger and the, and the firing pin or striker hits it. And you can do that in your home, shooting paper targets on the wall, yeah, so things like that. Your own gun. Yeah. yeah, so then you can elevate that to using some of our standalone targets that we have uh, the next booth over. Don't require a computer or anything like that. So we, we have different levels for all the different budgets out there to help them enhance their dry fire training. So then that brings us all the way up to our smokeless range. So this is our simulator. Starts at $500. That comes with these core 10 drills and our laser tracking camera. You just need a Windows PC and a projector, white wall. If you've got those things or you're willing to get them, you can set this up in your house and, and start training with a lot more interactive uh, dry fire. This is our gas blowback, uh, the Umarex gas blowback airsoft pistol. It's got our uh, laser barrel in it. So it's gonna give me recoil every time I pull the trigger. Nice. So that way I get the break and the reset and the trigger and a little bit of report from the from the recoil. Yep. So we'll go ahead and give that a try. So the objective is to shoot only the red targets out of the group. Hey. At the end it'll give you a score. 
and all of the drills have a way to make it easier or harder to help enhance your uh, or help to step you up as you train as you progress in your training gradually so, improve yes very nice well luke thank you so much for talking to us looks like a great product and uh hope you have a good rest of your convention very good you too thanks for stopping by thank you hey guys it's chad with tactical hive i'm here with barb today from laser ammo and she's going to give us a little uh demonstration and some information about their uh, product how are you doing, Barb? I'm doing great. How are you doing? Doing very well, thank you. All right, so what we have here is our IMTTS targets. This is only one of a series of electronic targets that we have. The great thing about this series of targets is it allows you to work in your dynamic movement, your transitions. You can place them around the room. These targets actually talk to each other. So you can connect up to 10 of them in a series uh, row around the room, however you want to do, to, based on your training needs. All right, can you give me a little demonstration? Yeah, absolutely. So actually new for this year, we have our IMTTS controller. Before, you would have to go back and forth to push the buttons. Mm -hmm. The controller allows you to stay with your student or if you're training alone, not have to go back and forth. All right, so let's get started. Let's see. All right. So I'm gonna hit start and it's going to go ahead, do a random shot timer, light up all the targets. We'll go ahead and shoot each one and then I'll show you the features of the controller. All right. Nice shooting. So, now with the IMTTS controller, we have our split times, actually our average, okay. and now we can toggle back and forth between each of our shots, showing split times for each one of those. Nice. So we can work more and more on decreasing that time. Very cool. All right, well, thank you so much for speaking with us, Barb. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. Thank have you.